Stevie Weeby here. So me and my girlfriend Ilani, we uh, finally got our own camping site at High Sierra. Camp High Sierra. Camp High Sierra. Uh, I'm currently enjoying nature right now and carving uh, my own personal state for the tent because we're missing one. So I'm really enjoying our day. Um, in nature as you can see we're surrounded by these beautiful trees and uh yeah thanks for tuning in <laughs> so we're at camp high sierra as you can see we sent it up we set up our uh this is our little setup for me and my gal yeah we got that to protect us from uh the sun and look at these beautiful trees man look at that this is exactly what we needed it's my girl right there, just relaxing. And then there's an awesome dog over there. And yeah, we're just enjoying our day. We're out near Mammoth Lakes here, huh? Look at that. Give you a little tour of the, um, the campground area. There's uh, actually public restrooms there's public restrooms as well as there's actually showers as well so i think where that uh that kind of that turquoise roof is where the bathroom is and i want to find out like look at everyone oh that's a cool looking tent it's like upright and this is everyone else's setup here it's our first time together as a couple so we're learning as we go um we're gonna get a for next time we're gonna just get a bigger tent i think we have everything else kind of like set in place but here's the bathrooms as you can see there's probably like hand washing stations as well and yeah see women men and uh yeah i'm gonna probably end it i'm not gonna feel myself taking a leak or nothing but i wanted to show you okay like hand washing area right there okay bathroom in there and then and then out here i'll end it with this there's some information here so you, you can bring dogs here okay so dogs on leash at all times quiet hours 10 p.m to 6 a.m prevent the spread please remember to keep social distance follow all the guidelines and this is the most important one bear warning do not approach a bear or its cubs and then they have these things called bear boxes with each of these um, sites, right? Locations, you, you put your ice chest right here, right? So you do not leave food, ice chest, or send your products in your vehicle. So these are, there's these bear boxes. You have to put all your like stuff in, especially your coolers, food, and it's like lotions, anything scented. Do not burn food on fire. Ring, dispose of trash immediately. Please don't feed the wildlife, obviously. So yeah firewood too that's what we need to get we need to get firewood so over here is the office as well i'll show you real quick i don't know if they're still open see there's bears everywhere here and then there's uh see what happened first oh i, I got another i'm gonna we, we got one of those log cabins over there and it was oof, not good but uh see those cabins over, over there yeah, it was basically if open when we we got number six and we opened it it was like kind of like basically nothing in there like these old ass janky mattresses that were like super thin it, it reminded me of like jail or something offices are here and then yeah and then those are the offices right there where you get your site and then those yeah don't don't get don't get one don't get those cabins get a site get a set campsite that's cool that's really cool and then yeah i'm just gonna take a leak and then yeah and then i'll just keep you guys posted we might i'll show you the lake and then we might get a boat one of these days go out in the water thanks for tuning in so basically i just i just discovered something i found out where the showers are so walking in here right you have your bathroom right your toilet but check it out the showers are right here check it out they got these showers Boom, one, two, three, four showers. So that's good to know, huh? I'm gonna tell my girl right now, she's gonna be psyched to, to know that, that I found the showers. 
Look, a little hand washing facility there. It's beautiful out here. I'm feeling better already. I highly recommend going camping, man. If you're near a mountain, you know, it's good times. Well, we're at Horseshoe Lake and we just saw boats in the water. So we're planning on definitely getting a boat tomorrow and fishing, right, babe? Yeah! Finally! <laughs> how beautiful this lake is we're at mammoth lake mary near lake mary right lake horseshoe no, lake horseshoe sorry horseshoe? I don't know. there's two of them now so this is our first meal at the campsite and uh babe can you explain what we're making here i think we're making like a steak a sirloin steak and there's a it's like a it's like a sirloin and, steak we will have corn and mm -hmm. uh, green peppers red peppers potatoes and we're gonna uh, f uh foil it up like bundle it up and put it over the campfire once we make the campfire right yeah. and it's gonna be delicious you should ask that guy now for okay till next time good morning good morning first morning from uh camping how was last night last start with the dinner the dinner was great we had um well, you found this very convenient uh, sirloin steak, green pepper, red pepper, potato thing um, that we could put in tinfoil and actually put over the campfire. And it was really exceeded my expectations. Really? Yeah, because the smoke from the wood actually... Um, added and um to the the flavor of all everything all the food in in the uh tin foil uh-huh it actually got that you got that smoke flavor uh -huh. and the way it was and the way the meat it was it, some of it tastes like kopi beef really moist and even the burnt ones tasted good so yeah it was because of like the, all the smoke is this smoke all yeah stuff. yeah yeah, you really ate, enjoyed you it. You ate like four steaks. <laughs> yeah, I felt like, like I told you, I felt like I ate like at a steakhouse or like yeah. like TGI Friday. Like, you know what I mean? Like a restaurant, like even a normal restaurant. Like I felt that full, like damn. Because we didn't eat the s'mores. Yeah. And we even uh, grilled the corn. Uh-huh. We could eat that for breakfast. Yeah, I did. Okay. So, yeah, and we couldn't eat even eat the corn and the s'mores. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And then... Ask me just two other questions. <laughs> just to make the vlog. <laughs> um, what do you think about, like, the wolves last night? <laughs> yeah, the wolves were kind of scary. It happened around, what, two or three in the morning? Because you kept peeing. I kept peeing, and I was scared. Did you pee, Jerry? I was scared to pee because I didn't know. It sounded like they were here. hyenas. Like, yeah. like, it was like they were, like... Like two gang wars. There is like like pa like two packs like in yeah. a gang war. It was scary. <laughs> <laughs> I was scared. Wait, what? <laughs> it sounded like curb like a hundred Kirby's fighting. <laughs> um, one more question. I like your questions. Um, Ask me what I think about the uh, what's this place called? Uh, hi. Sierra? Or Camp High Sierra. What? How? <laughs> Camp High Sierra. How do you like Camp, Camp High, High Sierra. Sierra? Great question. <laughs> I thought initially it was like, oh, this is like third or fourth choice. But since reviewing, because we've gone all to all the other, like the Lake Mary one and the other ones, mm -hmm. I think this is maybe one of the top ones. And ask me why. Why? Because of their accommodations and just the way the other sites are all like, you know, there's a lake by it, but everything's like compact. Everyone's like, squished. Everyone's squished together or like, you know, here it's like you're literally in the middle of the trees, okay. as you could see. Okay. Look. Yeah. Isn't that crazy? Yeah. So you're literally in the middle of the trees. And the secondly is the accommodations where... Right over there, and I, I, I gave him a tour yesterday, is you have a hand-washing station 
and there's showers and there's hot and cold water it's like really convenient so that's why i wanted to, i actually wanted to stay another day here but they don't have any open sites so we have to go elsewhere after starbucks yeah, yeah. so um that i guess is my overall review you are oh, you look like, so close to me <laughs> sorry like you're getting like my like nose hairs and stuff. Can you back up a little Sorry. bit? Okay, thank you. Um, I'm really looking forward to this next day or today because we could we can um, do like fishing, fish like water recreational activities on Whether hot springs. It's hot springs, fishing, or what's that one activity where they're standing up with the paddle? Oh, I don't. It's the that kind that of, looks I not fun that. like hawaii you know like in hawaii they did yeah we did that in hawaii. we're not in hawaii okay but i want to go on a boat okay i want to go on a, you want to go on a boat yep okay so thanks for tuning in we'll t talk to you soon bye. bye thank you so we're leaving this campground and uh we're trying to find out where to dump the trash you can't leave any trash behind so my girlfriend tells me to go to the front desk because she said there's a dumpster there. So I talked to this lady at the front desk and I go, um, is there a place to dump our trash, ma'am? And she goes, well, it's kind of far away. It's a ways away off to the left. And I go, well, are there any other places to drop our trash? She goes, well, at the front entrances, there's a uh, drop off points. Those are the only options. And I go, okay, okay, thank you. And so literally I take five steps back towards our campsite and I see the two green dumpsters right there. She made it seem like they were 10 miles away. Just thought I'd share that story with y'all. But she was a sweet lady. Till next time. Little. Hey babe, where are we? Oh, hold on, wait. Let me. Where are we? Okay, Stevie, we be here. We took a slight detour. Um, we are at the ancient bristlecone pine forest. <laughs> Why are we here? Because you wanted to visit this particular tree that's known to be over four thousand years old, and we drove. Ten, we're up 10,000 feet in elevation just for this one tree. Take a look. Okay, and we're going to enjoy the rest of our day. And uh, there's the look, listen, and discover. Okay, right here, there's one visiting center. And there's a toilet with no water. It's uh, just a hole. And um, we're gonna we're gonna say hi to uh, our friends, uh, the bristlecone. Oh. Hey man, where's the bristlecone at? Tell us where the trees are. Where's the bristlecone ancient tree? Oh, he ain't gonna tell us. So we're walking. So we're walking four miles in right now. I didn't expect to do a hike, <laughs> but we're doing a hike. Four miles in to find the neo of the bristlecone pine tree it's the one that's 4000 years old okay we can't even tell which one it is we can't tell which one it is they're hiding us identities we have to just intuitively know that that's the one okay so we're 4 miles in okay this is she wanted to do this today and we're doing it. We drove 45 minutes. We're really high up the mountain. Look at this. This is actually really cool. to stop here because of the time and everything but it's really beautiful i mean we're so high above everything we're ten thousand feet above everything 
As you can see, it's very vast and beautiful. We're actually short of breath because we're not used to the, this type of altitude. Um, but yeah, this is where we're at and it's beautiful. Um, and um, yeah, I would highly recommend if you if you like hiking to, to come up here. Ancient. The ancient. Uh, Bristle Pine. Br ancient Bristle Pine Forest. <laughs> Love y'all. Another pen to just drop Styling all these patterns with tornadoes of thought Are you waiting for this pattern to just write a new plot? Take a seat, I'll get you hoping like a soda to pop Cause I'm noble to hop, said my vocals will chop I'll set my local postals in this coast that is sod So I'll switch my point of view and make a gratitude list Not like where's my shit, but thank God for the gifts I'm not a perfect person in the fog of the mist Need to change the way I think I get those attitude fits